dear video first year students welcome back to the channel hope you are all doing well so if you are aiming to score more than 80 marks in the subject principles of programming using c so you have clicked on the right video i know uh, video has surprised a lot of students since from decades by setting unexpected papers for programmatic subjects okay so you can also ask your seniors how video is setting the papers for programmatic subjects but but don't worry friends i have compiled the most important questions in this video that have consistently appeared in the exams along with a few tricky ones that video might throw at you okay so i have made sure to cover every corner of the syllabus over here okay so subject code is a bpop s103203 so here is the model wise scoring package if you just go through these super important questions so you will surely get more than 80 marks in this particular subject so model one we have the super important questions like explain the organization of basic computer model with neat diagram explain the basic structure of c program almost in every examination vq is asking this particular question and also this one explain input output statement in c list and explain any two input output devices what are the basic data types available in c design a flow chart to calculate the sum of first 10 natural numbers find a variable explain the rules to declare a variable with example fifth one we have explained the characteristics of a digital computer with a neat diagram explain the steps in the execution of c program and next one we have explained and printf and scanf functions with their syntax give the illustrative examples discuss the classification of computers design an algorithm and program to find the area of a circle and eighth one we have explained the various rules for forming identifier names give an example for valid and invalid identifier last one we have compare between primary memory and secondary memory along with examples so let me tell you one thing over here you, you don't need to remember you don't need to memorize the programs it is all about understanding how the program runs and why they work right okay, so it is better to understand the concepts not only memorizing the programs okay that will go all in man if you are specifically from the uh, computer science branch or uh, ai branch then definitely it will help you in uh, future subjects okay whenever you go through the, the higher semesters that will surely strengthen your base for the upcoming subjects so, so if you are from any other stream rather than computer science or artificial intelligence but you have to understand the concepts also later on in the future if you are uh, learning some some languages so so surely this subject will help you over there also right so coming to the uh, model second which is also a passing module so first one is also a passing module second one is also a passing module in which you have to go through these super important questions like what is uh, type casting and type conversion explain type casting types with suitable example second one we have list and explain conditional branching and unconditional branching statements in c with example most important one and explain different types of loops in c justify uh, with its syntax and example explain the different forms of if statement with flowcharts and explain and the switch statement with an example also uh, explain break and continue statements with examples for each okay this may be the 10 marks question so practice writing programs uh, vtu loves to test your logic and syntax over there okay so practice helps you avoid silly mistakes in the programs so you should keep this thing in mind and also your focus should be on the flow charts and algorithms and uh, these are some scoring areas and mastering them can easily boost your marks so next one we have explained uh, for sorry explain the for loop with its syntax write a c program to find uh, whether given number is prime or not differentiate while and do while loops with examples and list all decision control statements in c explain else if later and nested if with its syntax and example and here are some most important programs which a video is frequently asking so write a c program to compute the roots of a quadratic equation by accepting the coefficients print appropriate messages and explain the various operators in c write a c program to find the largest of three numbers using ternary operator and write a C program to find the largest of three numbers using nested if statement and write a C program to simulate a calculator using switch statement these are four so these are four super important programs which you should surely practice now coming to the model third which is again a passing module Define an array explain with example how to declare and initialize 1d and 2d arrays list applications of arrays second one we have define function explain the type of functions based on parameters and third one we have discussed in detail the parts of a user defined function discuss the storage class is in c this is super important again define recursion write a c program to find the factorial of n using recursion then the syntax of function declaration function call and function definition with an example c program and here are some programs again most important ones so which are repeatedly asked questions write a c program to sort the elements using bubble sort technique by passing array as function argument write a c program to search an element using binary search technique write a c program to perform addition of two dimensional matrix consider three cross three ordered matrix uh, a and b okay or sometimes they will give you the transpose of 
uh, matrix you have to just write down the c program write a c program to perform a matrix multiplication and last one we have write a c program to swap two numbers using call by reference method so coming to module 4 you have to go through these super important ones like define a string list the string manipulation functions explain any two with examples define pointer explain how the pointer is declared initialize it with example mention the applications of pointers and discuss the various string handling functions in c write functions to implement string operations such as compare concatenate and string length convenience the parameter passing techniques next one we have explained pass by value and pass by address with example also explain string unformatted input output functions with example Example. fifth one we have differentiate between null pointer and void pointer with suitable example so these are the theoretical questions from module 4 now coming to programs we have here super important ones like uh, develop a C program using pointer to compute the sum mean and standard deviation of all elements stored in any array of n real numbers develop a C program to compare two strings without using built-in function write a C program to concatenate two strings without using built-in function and next one we have write a program to find length of given string without using built-in function last one we have write a c program to check whether the given string is palindrome or not without using built-in function okay these are some programs which are most important ones so if you are covering this much portion you will easily score in the subject model 5 is here differentiate between structures and union explain the types of structure declarations with example of each write a note on files enumerated data type opening a file in c so third one we have list and explain various file operations in C. Fourth one we have explain uh, f open, f close, f scan f, and f print f uh, with syntax and example uh, program considering all above functions and here are some programs which you have to cover write a C, C program to copy a text file to another read both the input file name and target file name write a C program to implement structures to read and write book title book author and book ID of n books write a C program to store and print name USN subject and IA marks of students using structure develop a C program to read and display the information of all the students in the class and last one we have implement structures to read write and compute average marks and student scoring below and above average in a class of n students okay so this is the scoring package of the principles of programming using c this is not on the passing package okay so if you want to pass the subject then definitely you have to go through three models fully and taking some uh, theoretical important questions from rest of the two models okay, okay that is the passing strategy but if you want to score more than 80 more than 90 then surely you have to go through these super important questions which will definitely help you in acing the principles of programming using c subject okay so i wish you all the best for your examinations dear make sure you will share this video to all your friends and batchmates and don't forget to like share and subscribe thank you